So, I have a outdoor unit, AC unit right here, and we're going to uh, wash the evaporator coils, I believe. So, to do so, I guess we're going to take off the top. Before we start all of this, we want to uh, turn off uh, the power, and you open up your junction box, and you just pull the lever out to kill the power. We're working with a, a train model, which is basically the, the name of it, but the parent company is called American Standard. And uh, just kind of let you know, this is a YCC03651M0BK, and m 0 bk and that will be in the summary notes for you to take a look at. But this is an all-in-one unit with the air conditioning and the heater built in one. So as we uh, lift this up, there's the fan right here. Disconnect it. Alright, let's lift it up. Push the side. So the circuit board is right here, and the start, like in the run start capacitor is down there. And then the heating unit where um, it takes the natural gas and heats up your um, air, goes through here, and the exhaust is right here. Condensing coil is right there, and then that's your compressor. And right here's the furnace. Those tubes are the furnace right there. The blower is right there, and the evaporator coil is right there. This is the air intake comes from here, and you can see the bugs and everything. So we're going to clean this. So right now we are uh, going to mix the solution. And it's uh, one part cleaner to three to six part uh, water. So we have, that's our one part. So that's about one to four or five part. Spray? Yeah, sure. So now we're going to spray from, since the air is going from this direction, we're going to spray on the other end. Then you can spray the other end from an angle. Yeah, that's good. And you just want to fully saturate the evaporator coil. And you want to roll the dirt off. And let it soak for ten, five minutes or so. Then we'll rinse it down with water. Since we still have more solution, we're just going to go ahead and clean the um, condensing coil as well, too. We're going to rinse it using a water hose, and this is just for the outdoor unit. Otherwise, you should probably use a sprayer full of clean water to, to clean it. So we're just going to let it flow from the top down and it's going to come out the uh, drain pipe through the drain pan. This is after you let it soak for a little while. Oh, okay. So this is the end result of the evaporator coil and it's extremely clean compared to before. Uh, so uh, and the condensing coil is also a lot cleaner right now and we're just going to put the top on.